Hello guys, this is Mauro from PrintInfoTech.com and in this video I just uh, want to show you how to create uh, your Surface RT recovery image drive so you can recover from the uh, uh, Windows RT 8.1 update. As you, uh, if you remember or if you heard, um, Microsoft have to uh, pull out the, uh, the Windows RT 8.1 uh, update uh, from the uh, Windows Store because of some uh, issues still the company uh, hasn't uh, put the uh, uh, the update back in the store but today we have um, an update that uh, that the company put up that uh, anyone can download and it's gonna help to uh, fix uh, the the issue and hopefully to continue finishing the uh, the Windows 8.1 update for uh, your Surface RT. So the first thing you, <coughs> you can do is just uh, come to my site and uh, uh, do a search for download Surface RT recovery image to fix Windows RT 8.1 problem and what you'll find there is, uh, is a link right here from Microsoft that will take you to the uh, download center and here you can download the uh, Surface RT recovery image just uh, this is the link right here just uh, go to that one then just uh, click download choose all the uh, all the files the um, the surface RT 8.0 as, as you can see it's 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 not the uh, Windows 8.1 update image that you're getting you're only getting the 8.0 so you can fix the uh, the update so the the uh, surface can still boot up later so and this is only for the North America uh, version so that's English so just uh, go ahead click next and it will download I already done the download so what I'm going to show you is how to create uh, your drive so you can uh, recover your your surface RT so once you download the um, the image you will have a file something like this this is a Surface RT 8.0 North America it's about 3, 3.5 almost like 4 gigabytes right click on it and click extract and just make sure you know that uh, um, you have the uh, show extracted files when completed click extract and that will take a while and then you will have a, a folder like this right here and with the files that you need to to copy and in, into the uh, into a USB drive so the next thing you have to do is just uh, uh, have um, just connect a USB a USB drive in your in your computer and now we're going to need to format that drive make sure that uh, you copy off any files to a temporary location so you can you can format the USB drive just uh, on your drive just right click on it and click format and we're gonna be using a FAT32 file system and you can name this something like recovery Remember that this will delete everything on the uh, on the USB drive. Click, click OK. Now it's clean and ready. Close. And now the only thing you have to do is just uh, enter to the uh, folder where the uh, files are for your uh, Surface RT recovery image select them all copy open your USB drive and paste them in there this is gonna take a while so I'm gonna pause the video and then I'm gonna come back when this is finished okay so uh, we're pretty much done here uh, remember that uh, the USB drive that you wanna use has to be uh, 4 uh, gigabytes on site or even larger to like fit all the uh, all the files 
Now the only thing you have to do is just to plug the USB and the device and follow the, uh, I, I got some instructions on this guy and how to repair surface with a Windows RT 8.1 update failure. You can follow the uh, instructions here, just, you know, turn on the uh, the device and pressing the uh, the volume down button and the power button and just you know press that and until you see the uh, surface logo go to troubleshoot advanced options and then go to the command prompt and type this command boot rec forward slash rebuild bcd press enter and type uh, exit to quit and, and trying to like boot the uh, the uh, your surface once again you, sh you should be able to to complete the uh, Windows RT 8.1 update and uh, also you can follow the instructions from the uh, from the file that you downloaded the PDF file that uh, that you downloaded from the um, from the Microsoft Download Center so that's basically all you have to do and I hope this video was informative for you and I'd like to thank you for viewing.